Dark Water. Okay. What I like to do here is sprint to open up the door and then run back. Go here. See, I'm pretty safe here. Should be two guys. Okay. You're going to take a little bit of damage there, but it's okay. You can also open up the door and just wait for them to bust through the door and shoot them like that. Okay. Just make sure after you shoot the first guy, you wait maybe four or five seconds because the second guy will come kind of flash around the corner. So be ready for that. Hey, okay. stand in this corner and wait for your teammates to clear out the enemies. Okay, that's the all clear. Okay, go prone here. Your teammates will clear out the two enemies coming out of the door. Okay, then we're going to kill this enemy. Ghost, we're moving to the main deck. What's your okay, it's going to leave the door open. We're going to come here and wait. Our teammates will clear out the next area for us. Grab the Simtex, the next room, here, and then sprint all the way through. Jump on top of the blue crate, keep going. Probably gonna take a little bit of damage here, that's okay. The goal is to get here, and then we wait. Notice the checkpoint. Wait for our teammates. See how safe it is. Be careful because sometimes an enemy over here will shoot you. N notice how he says move to the helipad, Sergeant. That's usually a good sign that you're uh, safe to push out. Wait here for a few seconds. There's a checkpoint. Now slowly crouch walk through here. There's enemies above us. So. Wow, really? <laughs> I guess a tank exploded. It's okay. We're right back here. Yeah, I think they did accidentally. But uh, well, they threw a grenade and destroyed that tank. All right. Be careful here. Because there's a guy. Sometimes your teammate will clear him out for you, but most of the time he won't. And sprint across here and then wait. For your teammate to push through and clear out the hallway about four or five guys down there so just be aware that sometimes when your teammate says that everything is clear he's lying sometimes there's still one guy down there sometimes okay i like to do this just to make sure make sure there's nobody down there and then make your push okay All right. Where are the controls? On that damn ship. Actual, we got a problem. Missile is armed. Controls are somewhere on the ship. You have your orders, son. Stop that launch. Alejandro, take over watch. So here with me, we're moving to that ship. I'll keep you covered. Next part's tricky. It's very easy to die. You have to worry about crates that are being shuffled around on top of the, uh, uh, or I guess I should say on the ship. And uh, they can kill you in one hit. They can gradually deal a little bit of damage. You can get stuck on them. It's all kinds of problems. And of course, you got to worry about the enemies too. I'm going to show you guys where to go so you can at least avoid all the crates. But you'll still have to deal with the enemies, okay? 
Doesn't matter if you die here. There's plenty of checkpoints. Just keep pushing the action, okay? We're going to go to the left. And sprint all the way to this area. Make sure you avoid all the crates. We're trying to get here. Hold this angle. Sometimes enemies, there's one, likes to flank around. Wait for your teammates to get into position. And then you can be a little bit more aggressive with your angle. Notice how the crates can't bother me. Now, if you're too, um, if you push too close to the entryway, they'll still be able to do damage. So just be careful. You can pop out of cover. Let's see if you can see any enemies. see anybody okay there's a red crate there that's where we're trying to go okay all the way through crouch wait get close to it but don't get behind it because it'll kill you just make sure your left shoulder is up against it and then when you see it go away from the wall there push through you want to get here Again, hold this angle and look for enemies. Got him. One more, come on. I know there's more. Sometimes you can get shots on enemies right there. I just saw somebody flash around. See this angle right here? Okay. Now, the trickiest part is the guy that's up in the tower. Let me show him to you in a second. I just want to make sure this angle is clear. Okay. All right. Aim high here. And shoot the guy that's up there. He's very hard to hit, very hard to see. You can even spam some shots up there. Like that. He's very tricky to get, but he's brutal. He has to be dead. I think I got him. Yeah, I think he's dead. Now, there's usually one or two more guys. So when you think it's safe, it's not. There's usually one or two more guys. So I like to push to the next area up there. Just leapfrog. Like this. That's usually enough to force them out. Yep, there he is. I got one of them. There should be one more unless they've picked him up already. There he is. Peek out, son. Left side's clear. I don't know if I got him or not. He shouldn't bother me when I make this run. I think he might be dead. Okay, we should be okay. All right, let's make the run. See what happens. We're trying to get here. Then you just want to walk and shoot. Like that, okay? Watch your back, make sure nobody follows you. Your teammates should push through in just a second. And then you know you're good. Checkpoint, okay, that should be good. Just don't want to, I, do, I just don't want an enemy to follow me in here. I think we're gonna be okay. Okay, when you get here, look up, be careful. Sometimes an enemy will flash around this I guess this weird angle here. I think he's over here. Oh. I think our teammates got him. Yeah. Once you start to see your teammates up there, you're safe. But sometimes, in fact, there's the enemy right there. One of those two guys will sometimes be right here. And you'll only be able to see their head. 
So you want to kind of edge that out like that and kill him. Okay, now we breach. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, the toughest part's coming up here. Well, I guess that's kind of tough, but this part's tough for uh, different reasons. Okay, I like to run out here and then run back. That forces the guy out, and he always goes to the kitchen. Okay, then what you can do, kind of just stay behind this and get ready to toss a Simtex. That's usually enough to kill the guys in the kitchen, but just to be sure, see he's still alive. So you want to be careful. See, it didn't quite kill them both. You start sprinting through here, he'll kill you quick. Don't use more than one Simtex though. On you, Sergeant. Then just keep edging out until you see him. I think I just got him. Yep. Push to this corner. Look over here and make sure there's no enemies. Go prone. This guy. See how my teammate picked him up? Or should pick him up. Next time he didn't pick him up, or at least they didn't pick him up quick enough. But you can, of course, kill him. That's the reason why you want to go prone, because you got that table for cover. And then if he's still alive when you get here, you'll be able to kill him from this angle. Okay. All right. When you come up these stairs, look, get ready to fire on this guy. It's kind of hard to hit because you're bouncing around, right? Then you want to flash. So L1. And again, just kind of strafe. Get here. Mount. And there should be a guy here unless he's already dead. Couldn't, uh, didn't have an angle on him mounting. But just know there's a guy there. You want a Simtex here. That's usually enough to kill the guys in that room. I like to play this extremely safe though. Because this guy can kill you fast. Be careful here. He's in that room. There he is. Most of the time the Simtex kills him, but if it doesn't, just be ready. And then I've had a second guy pop out here, which I haven't been able to account for, so be ready for that too. Just make sure this area is clear. Push forward. Alright, when you get here, sprint across. And then shoot those guys as they go up the stairs. Now, if you don't kill them that quick, it's okay. When you push into this room, they're going to throw a grenade at you like that. Okay? Just get safety. And then you're looking for... We're going to switch guns here. You're looking for this angle. Sometimes they're going to be right up there. Let me... um. Here, let me uh, switch guns. They're usually right up here. If not, just keep edging out like this. Okay, I think we're safe. Get ready to flash. Okay, let's wait. I don't like this gun. Sometimes I like to flash out here too. You can uh, flash, Simtex. You can sprint over here. Your teammates will push up. And then you can Simtex over here if they're still alive. It's usually enough to clear them. All right, eyes on the controls. Now we're good. Tapping in. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Fuck. We can't disarm it. 
Why? It's too late. There's no abort code? Yeah, well, that window's closed on that, boys. Gold Eagle Actual, this is Shadow One. Missiles in boost phase about to burn. How come? Solid, Shadow. We can't disarm, then we detonate. Roger that, Actual. Stand by. Soap, get on the controls. We're gonna have to do this together. Now, the clock is ticking, so we gotta move, brother, all right? All right, let's do it. I'm in. Actual, we're on the con. What's the order? Input the Dow code and let the payload strike. What's the Dow code? Detonate after launch. We're gonna take out the oil rig with the missile. Alejandro's by there with the shadows. All stations, clear the rig now. I say again, clear the rig. Roger, what's the count? One minute. Copy on the move. All right, Soap, get on the controls. We need it in diagnostic mode so I can bypass the login. Soap, hit the clear and mode keys at the same time. So that's clear and mode, square and O. Wait, what's happening? A little techno wizardry. Okay, now I need the last digit on row two, column one. It's C, Charlie. Perfecto. It's headed for New Orleans. Not anymore. Target updated. Hit execute. We're set. All right. Let's enjoy our handiwork. There it is. All right, guys. This mission is supposed to be stealth. What we're going to do is be a little bit more aggressive. I'm going to show you guys how to kill most of the enemies. Because my fear is that even if I show you how to stealth it, is that it may not work out for you. It could be um, something you do by mistake or just the pattern of the AI may not always be in the same position for you as they were for me. And it's going to end up being a combat situation anyway. That's what I'm going to demonstrate. Obviously, you can play through some of these combat areas um, in a stealthy manner if you'd like. Do it. Sneak past these enemies. I'm crouched here. You can stand here, just don't run. Always found some dirty cops around the corner here. Let's go have a word with them, shall we? Creeping Jesus. Grab the binding. Poor bastard. On the rope. That's a star. And grab the metal. There's also a graphical glitch on this game. I just experienced it. Where there's a bunch of lights on the screen. If that happens, guys, just close your game, reboot your application, and it should go away. Okay, up on the D-pad, we're going to craft the pry tool. Notice that it takes binding and metal, okay? Really, the only thing we have to pick up to complete this mission is binding, metal, wax, and chemicals. Everything else is optional, okay? And it's... It's also possible for you guys to use your pry tool to open lock boxes. There's no need to do that either. We're just mainly going to use them to open these doors. Okay. But again, you can, if you can find the resources, you can gather more materials. Open this door and then close it. Sometimes the enemy will follow you in here and then wait for these guys to go outside. Like they're outside. Sneak past them. I'm crouched here. Don't sprint. Obviously, they're going to hear you. And they will follow you up here. Yeah, you can stand up here. Take a right and grab the headlamp. And then grab the binding here. Turn. Go back down the hallway. Get the metal and the binding on the nightstand. What's the lightest? Marks the metal. Everything in their path. War crimes. Makes me want to commit a few war crimes of my own. Surely. It won't stand. Think we'll get a green light. Go through the bathroom. No more green lights, Johnny. We're on our own. And then craft another pry bar. Alejandro. Alejandro, All of those dialogue choices don't matter, guys. You can just let the time run out or select one of them. Go ahead. 
good here. Those fucking bells. What's going on up there? You want to go check it out? Dog, bed. I don't see anything. I'll stick around just in case. Give me a sit rep. Outside. Keep it, Ali. Grab the wax, then head outside. Crouch. Wait for them to kill this enemy. There's another glitch where this enemy that they just uh, actually they're going to shoot him here. He'll actually get back up <laughs> after he dies and uh, shoot you. So just be careful. If he pops up, it'll yeah. He didn't pop up that time. But a lot of times when you jump off that platform, he'll just pop back up and shoot you. It's weird. Grab this bottle. And we're just going to throw the bottle. L1 over there. Strike the guard and then sprint past him. Okay, you can grab this wax. And then head inside this area and get the chemicals. You don't need the trap, but you can grab it if you want to. Okay. Grab this binding. I like it. Up on the D-pad, and we're gonna craft a smoke bomb. Binding, wax, and chemicals. That's what you need. Okay. Crouch. Wait for these guys to get into position. You want to get extremely close before you throw this bomb. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to sprint down the hallway for safety. Because they're going to shoot you in the back. Sprint past them. Oh, I got, I got caught. It's going to go to the last checkpoint. Okay, I've already got it crafted. Let's try that again. Most of the time, that guy doesn't back up and block your path or maybe I've always been able to beat him to that hallway so we'll just cut through the middle okay now you're safe sprint down the alley that's passionate don't know here speak English it's raining fucking hard the lock boxes that I was telling you guys about, it's over there. You're going to see a bunch of those around the area. Again, you don't have to uh, worry about those, but you can get them if you want to. Grab the metal. Make sure that you grab this knife. And then grab the shotgun. You must have a knife. Several. I think I found one. You came through here. On my way to the church. And you left me. Okay. I'm used to working alone. So much for no man left behind. Just get yourself to the church. Trying to keep you alive and get you in one piece. This is not an enemy. One of us needs to survive to tell the tale. Just a <laughs> regular guy. Okay. You can drop off here. Don't mind if I do. All right, guys. Guy's got no gun. He won't get far. Now we're in business. Four ones. Ghost dangerous. Soap. Found the tripwire ready to a shotgun. Disarmed it. Took Open the gun. that up. Open hearts and minds with it. Sprint. Johnny. Town's full of keep tunnels. sprinting. One leads out from the church. Doesn't matter if you get shot. Just keep going. Turn the corner. Post up here. Mount. And wait. Still up, Roy. So far, so good. You could also grab bottles to get through that previous area. You know, distract the guards, but you just want to get here. And these enemies will bring you ammo. Again, you can sneak through this area if you want to. It'll be a lot quicker. Well, I don't know. It depends on which route you take. But this will ensure that no matter what, you'll be able to get through this area even if the enemies become aggressive. 
You can still die here, but it's just very hard for them to kill you. And like I said, they're going to be bringing this ammo and you can actually turn your camera like that. You can see down the alley a little bit better. So you can see when they when they're coming. You can also look for their lights, obviously. They start hitting you just back up like this. Just wait. Very hard for them to come back here and get you. See, I got my health back. Nice. And just wait. So take some time. But you guys are pretty safe back here. They will come from this uh, side of the hallway as well. So you may have to shoot them here. Just be careful. You don't have to kill everybody. You just need to thin them out enough so you can get to the next checkpoint. If I can push out. There's, there's a guy. See how they come from that side? Sometimes you have to push out here to get them to be more aggressive. See how I just decreased that angle by getting behind this dumpster? Just play it cool. And again, if you guys do get the graphical glitch, you'll know it when you see it. There's a bunch of lights on the screen. Then uh, this is actually a good place to go. Because even though there's going to be a lot of lights on the screen, it's very confusing. You can just kill all the enemies. It's very hard to sneak through the game with that graphical glitch. See how I'm just pushing out there, trying to get them to be a little bit more aggressive. Might have to pop out and shoot this guy. Maybe that one shot will make him advance. Sometimes just shooting wildly in an area will force them out. See how I backed up there? Stay cool. Stay cool. See that? Getting my health back. Then pop out and get the kill. Very hard for them to shoot you here. Even though he clearly had a beat on me. It's like you didn't know if he should shoot or not. And it's just because I backed up and decreased the angle. Notice how the, the garbage can covers the door up here. The door frame keeps you safe. Still a few more enemies, but it may be safe to make the run. There's still one guy down there I'm worried about. I need to make a left turn and go down the hallway here without getting shot in the back. That's the problem. Once you get to this position, you got to kill your way out of here. You know what I mean? but it's pretty safe. And don't worry about ammo. Like I said, all these enemies have ammo and shotguns. They get too close like that. Take them down with the knife. That's why I had you guys get the knife earlier.
Okay. I don't see any more flashlights. So I think we're okay. I'm gonna grab a see if I can grab a different shotgun here with some more ammo. It's got 10. Okay. 12. Should be good. Watch this corner. Push up. Now, this is another good spot. If you get here, you can actually take down all the enemies when they come into this area. They'll just rush you and just use your knife to kill them, or you can shoot them with the shotgun. So, either behind the dumpster or here, okay? Just gonna pick up some more binding and metal here. And do I see any enemies? I think we're good. So this is where you're trying to go. So that's where we came out of. So if you can stealth your way across here, it's pretty quick. But just in case you have a hard time, that's how you can be aggressive there. Okay, this is another tricky spot. Lots of enemies. You can actually post up over here. Some more metal behind you. Mount, just fire, and wait. They're going to line up for you right here. And the shotguns are really OP in this game, so you kill them. If they hit you, just back up, get your health back, and then mount again. They've never rushed me in this room, but if they do, you can just shoot them or, you know, knife them. Wait. Got him. I think that might have been the last one. I think there's only like maybe three or four enemies there. I think we're okay. Let's be careful. Okay, now you're able to get a second weapon. I've got two shotguns. I'm gonna stick with the shotties. I would urge you guys to do the same. Then just push on through. Okay, for this section, you want to stay to the right Talk to me, Johnny. I found the tunnel. The as much as possible. The the so go under the water when you get to this column and just keep following the right wall. Now you can sneak behind here. You'll have to get in close and find the gaps. Go as far as you can. Let's keep going. You can peek out, not peek out of the, you're not peeking out of the water. <laughs> you're coming out of the water for air, right? When you see this guy with the next light, push past him, get some air. Just trying to make it to the steps. So you're sticking to the right side for protection, and then you're going down the left. There's gonna be like a fork in the road, if you will, in the tunnels. You're gonna take the left path and then just make it to the stairs. You might have to review that because I was underwater and everything, right? Kind of hard to follow along. Now here, it's up to you. You can grab this gun if you want to. Um, trying to think. As long as you have one shotgun, I would get the other gun, okay? So make sure you have a shotgun and, gun and a regular gun here. Just gonna get the one with the most ammo, 816, 216. Okay, switch it out for this one. Okay. You're gonna need this gun, not necessarily for the up, upcoming combat sequence, but for the next one, okay? It's really good to have this gun. We don't need any more binding or anything, so just open up the door. And sometimes you will die here because you will not be able to run past the enemy that's on the floor. This guy's gonna get shot. 
that may happen to me. You just cannot get past him, and then the enemy shoots you. Okay, you're gonna need to make a push to the left side. Just immediately run. You may have to get your health back here. Trying to make it down the alley. Just like that. Just keep running. Okay, cut through here. When you get here, go prone. Crawl. You're going to see some guys show up down here. When you do, cut to the left inside these buildings. See the enemies right there? Cut through here. Wait for them to uh, go past. They may have already done it. You can see him right there. There's the checkpoint. I may have already crossed. Wait, I hear him. There they go. Okay, they're coming through here. Or they look down the alley. I mean, just give it a few seconds. You want them to fully cross. And then you want to just sneak past them. Just start sprinting here all the way through. And that will get you guys past that entire sequence. And this is where having that gun is going to come in handy. Because you need to get some long range kills here. It's possible to sneak past. Um, I wish I could show you both methods. When you get here. Actually, I'll, I'll show you both methods. So let's just say, for instance, that you only had two shotguns here. You would just run back the same way that we came. Okay. If you don't feel comfortable Stay with that, sharp. you can no post up here and just shoot enemies in front of this truck here, or sometimes they'll actually come behind ghost here. You just want to focus, like I said, or you could just backtrack the same way that we came until you get to the next objective, which is to uh, find a truck so we can get out of here. Heads up for a vehicle we can take. I may have to push out a little bit here from getting to spawn in. They should be spawning in. It's kind of weird they're not spawning in. What's going on? Wait, what? This mission is so glitched, dude. It never plays out the same way. There's supposed to be enemies spawning in here, like four or five enemies, and then an enemy back here behind him. But they're not spawning in for me, so I'm going to... I think you guys get the point. There will be some enemies over here. Just hang tight. Remember, Ghost is going to be clearing out a bunch of them too. You just want to be ready here. trying not to shoot them because I don't want them to know that I'm over here but obviously sometimes you may have to right now they're all distracted so I got this wall here for cover so they can't see me Didn't expect him to flash around, but that's why you want to con continuously look in that direction. Just in case Ghost doesn't pick them all up. There's the truck we're trying to get to. Remember, use use your walls for cover. Not really for um, protecting you against gunfire. It's more visual cover.
he's still shooting at people so I'm gonna play this safe Here we go. 